But right now, when you're winning, you're not going to make that change. So whether they have that lined up, whether that is ready to go, as long as this Colorado Rapids team is winning, you can't make that change because what message does that send to Connor Casey, to the other members of the staff, to the players? So right now, if Connor Casey wants to do everything he can to stake his claim as the head coach and remove that interim title, well, it's simple. Just keep winning. What you didn't see moments before Brent Coleman and why he's so frustrated right now was he felt there was little contact off the ball. He was actually down inside the box as that ball got played out wide to Kai Kamara. He quickly realizes he has to pop up just off your screen. He realizes where it's at. He's under pain. He's in some, some discomfort, but he realizes he has to get back up in that moment. He does. He concedes the corner and goes over and has the word, but that's tough defending for Brent Coleman. Kevin Molino finding Mason Toy as he pulls off the back shoulder. And how about that for a touch from Mason Toy? Kevin Molino find that little pocket of space. It's brilliant, it's smart play. It's exactly what he's supposed to do in that role. But Mason Toy, how's your touch, kid? Bring it down inside the box, top of the six. Your first start of the season. Curl into the back of the corner and then go give us your trademark celebration. Welcome back into Allianz Field as FC Dallas and Minnesota United are all tied nil-nil at the half. Well, we are very fortunate enough to be joined down here on the field by Scottish midfielder John McGinn, a part of Aston Villa. And John, first of all, your first impressions of Allianz Field and how excited you to play here on Wednesday night? Uh, very impressive. What was that moment like for you knowing that goal was what ended up pushing Villa back into the Premier League? Yeah, it's crazy. Everyone said it's the, it's the richest goal in football. Um, I don't see much of that money, but uh, it was an amazing feeling, even to play at Wembley on that kind of occasion. But to score the winning goal and, and get Villa back to the Premier League is something I'll, I'll never forget. You get joked about it. it's the richest goal and what's dubbed <laughs> the richest game in football. Congratulations on that moment. Congrats on all your success. All the best. And we'll see John and Aston Villa Wednesday night right here at Allianz Field. We'll stick around. There's still plenty more to come on the Element Electronics halftime show as Minnesota United FC Dallas are tied 0-0.